Hello, I'm John from WestchesterRealEstateValues.com. Thank you for stopping by. Today's topic is going to focus on 10 ways to save money on home renovation. Now these are the 10 commandments for working financially responsible and being able to pull off the renovation without having to go into debt. The first is set a budget and stick to it. Figure out how much a renovation is going to cost within your means and then set a ceiling that that's all you're going to spend. Don't start on the project without knowing what the end result is going to look like or cost. Number two, make every effort to save on material costs. There are discounts, there are uh, volume sales, there are special age appropriate uh, pricing if you're a senior over the age of 50. But also, there's number three, good deals on essential materials that have been repurposed. And many of these repurposed items fit very well. I did an entire deck based on repurposed tracks. It's a synthetic composite that's even more durable than normal decking. And yet, it was a couple years old, and I got it for a fraction of the price. It worked out great, and then I put a sealer on it. Nobody would know it was repurposed. Rush the renovation process. Set a timeline, understand. It could come in before or after that time frame. But when you're working within a budget, and you have contractors that are running multiple deals, the fact of the matter is there are circumstances beyond anybody's control. And that could be weather, climate, or having workers show up on time. Making big purchases until the items go on sale. If you're gonna be doing an entire construction within your kitchen, watch out for when sales for appliances are being made. You already know what the dimensions are. You can already set it up with uh, the contractor to scale the counters, the kitchen, and whatever to those dimensions, and it can be done and then you can keep your eye out when the sales come. Look around when hiring help for renovations. Don't go with just the first contractor you meet. Interview a couple of them, estimate, so you know if it's gonna fall within your budget and you know about his materials and whether it'll be repurposed or not. That's very important. Lastly, and this is just as important, be aware a lot of your old appliances, kitchen utensils, or a uh, bathroom can be sold. It can be sold online and you can actually generate income from it. Keep this in mind for raising money to pay forward in your renovation. Thank you for visiting. This is John from WestchesterRealEstateValues.com. Like, share, subscribe. And if you have a comment or a question, send it on in. I'll be more than happy to get you the information. Bye-bye.